a bottle of water and be like, oh, I'm just gonna try to swallow this all in one second. Yo, welcome back to the second channel. My name is Prince Charming and we're gonna be checking out some real fast eaters today. I've never been a real fast eater, so um, I, I, I actually, okay, I take that back, actually take that back completely. I have been told I vacuum my food. I have been told that I completely swallow it. And there was actually this one time, I went to IHOP with this one girl and I literally did not look up. I was just scarfing my food down. And she's like, do you even chew? Do you just swallow it like a vacuum? And she, yeah, it was, it was a pretty messy sight. <laughs> What was- hold on. What was that? A banana? Did he swallow it? Hold on. Did this man swallow the banana? Take it out. Swallow it again? Okay, um, so yeah, I mean, I guess some people have skills like that and we're only six seconds in the video. I mean, I've seen- I've seen some girls do that. I'm not gonna lie, I've seen some girls do that. I've seen some videos of that happening. Honestly, bro, that's- that's a skill. And pause on this. But that really is a skill that's an accomplishment. I only say that because I brush my tongue. Like, because I hope you brush your tongue. And if you don't, you have stank breath. But I brush my tongue when I brush my teeth. So I can't go back too far. And if I do, I gag. So I don't know how someone can humanly swallow a banana, take it out, and then swallow it again. But hey, go ahead. You have some crazy human skills. Oh, is, is, are they both going to do it? Oh, I think he's just going to do it. Oh! Oh no, 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 honey. No, honey, please no. Hold on. Why are y'all. Is that something y'all are proud of? <laughs> okay. You're gonna drink all that water in a second? Let's see how he does it. Okay, he got a little sip in. Oh! Okay. Okay, that was pretty impressive. I'll have to give him that. That was pretty impressive, guys. I thought I can chug pretty fast. I thought if you hand me a beer and I shotgun it, I can do it pretty quick. But he literally just... I, I didn't even see it go into his mouth because I didn't see his mouth like get like... Because there was like water in it. It literally just went straight from the bottle down his throat. Pause. Ugh. <laughs> Where did they find out that they, that, they, that they have these skills? Like, do you just one day have to get uh, a bottle of water and be like, oh, I'm just going to try to swallow this all in one second? <laughs> okay, maybe not the best idea to try. But yeah, if he could do it, maybe you can too. I, I obviously can't do it. Uh, you just saw me on camera failing. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, okay. You you got it, bro. You got to eat all those hash browns. Eat all those McDonald's hash browns. Hey, you can say what you want about McDonald's. They got the breakfast. I always get the egg sausage, cheese McMuffin, hash brown, orange juice. Oh, that's a breakfast. You good, bro? I don't think... Uh, he, good? he good? You good? All right, all right. He good. He good. Swallow. Don't forget to swallow. <laughs> Man, these people in the competitive eating business is crazy because they, they do this so... You gonna choke? Oh, God! Like, it'd be feeling like a lot of these people are going to choke because they, <laughs> they be stuffing so much food in their mouth and I'd just be wondering, how can you possibly contain this much food? Another thing I also wonder about all these competitive either eaters is how do they stay so skinny? Because, yes, I understand that maybe not you know all of them eat every second of the day they're not competitive eating every second of the day maybe once or twice a week at most i don't know i don't know their schedule around it but still eating that much calories in one sitting i'm pretty sure it can throw off an entire week for somebody and making a career out of it i don't know you have to be working out crazy if you want to be a competitive eater and stay fit because most competitive eaters that i see they're not fat and i always wondered why all right, come on, you got this, bro. He really looks like he's finna choke. Are you okay, bro? You okay, bro? Oh, that's so gross. He gotta mix all that. <laughs> so he he killed an entire box of pizza in less than a minute. You got it. Oh, he did it. He actually did it. So how long is it gonna take for him to eat these Pringles? Why would you want to do this, though? That's what I wonder, bro. I will puke my intestines up if I try to competitive eat. All those Pringles too, bro? I guess he has a smart approach because if I try to stick my hand in that Pringle can, I'm not getting any access anywhere. You got it, you got it. 27, 28, 29, 30. You see, with dry foods like that, that has to be so hard to do. Like, it's 
Pringles. They're potato chips. They're not potatoes. They're like chips, but they're actually not potatoes. Fun fact. Because like with a hot dog, I heard you dip it in water, you chew it, you're good. But with all these dry foods, they'll dry your mouth, they'll dry your throat. No wonder they have a, a liquid next to them, a cup of water, a bottle of water, this or that, because bro, I could only imagine how dry his mouth must be. I did the saltine cracker challenge and I couldn't even do that. And this man's finna kill an entire Pringles can in less than a minute, I'm guessing. So yeah, that is gonna be very insane to watch. You got it, bro. We, we in here for you. Oh, he looks like he's going through it, bro. Oh, no, no, no. He dropped his water. <gasps> he dropped his water. He no longer has liquid to save him. Golly. <laughs> I mean, let's go ahead and give him that win. All those crumbs, bro. Let's go ahead and give him that win. Let's go ahead and... I'll give him that win. I'll... I, I'll take that. What is this? What? <laughs> what are you laughing? Okay, okay. I'm not one to judge on his appearances as I'm about to judge on somebody's appearance. Oh my. But come on. He, he looked a little different. He looked just a little different. He, he wasn't the worst looking guy in the world. He just he just a little, 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 little different. And the way he killed that watermelon... <laughs> I just didn't know. He kind of has my laugh too. I know it didn't really have sound, but it, my laugh kind of overlapped when he was laughing. So it was it was kind of hilarious. So we're going to go ahead and watch this again. And I'm, I'm going to kind of, you know, narrate his laugh for y'all. All right, there you go. He's just like, he's like, oh, look at this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Why are you yelling at me? Okay. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness. That's why you were yelling. Oh. Hey, you already know that's how I be up between your girls. Like, like okay, friend. This is supposed to be G rated. It's supposed to be G rated. I see now why he was yelling, man. He he dominated that watermelon. He completely dominated. I didn't even know a watermelon could be dominated like that, bro. <laughs> you okay? Is is everything okay at home? Are your parents fighting? Are they are they yelling at you? Because it seems like you're taking out some personal anger out on that watermelon. But I love the way it was cut. Um, I've seen the way a uh, watermelon gets cut like that, and it just is so attractive to me because it's like a big ball that you can just bite into. You don't have to worry about the skin, the peel, this or that. You just bite into it, and you have watermelon goodness. Even though I don't like watermelon, <laughs> crazy thing, right? <laughs> All right. Why does it have to be a black guy and a chicken? Why? No. No. <laughs> Did y'all hear him? They're like, he loves chicken. Like, <laughs> why y'all gotta do this to the black kid? I mean, it could have been any kid. It does, this is not a race thing, but you got. I already know the people recording are white. I, I can tell by their voice the way it sounds. Like these are a couple of white kids recording their black friend <laughs> eating a chicken. <laughs> And he's okay with it. And he's okay with it. That's the crazy part. I would never let anybody record me eating a chicken wing, bro. Do you know how much jokes gonna just can't just come from that? I'm good. I kind of like my dignity. I don't need the internet seeing me, you know, scarfing a chicken wing in three seconds. Cause I can do that. That's not even a, that's not even a skill, bro. If you're African, you can do that by default. Oh my gosh, just just look at his face. <laughs> he's so happy about this. All right, let's see. Let's see it. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. He really did do it in two seconds. He literally just put it in his mouth and then out comes a bone. <laughs> It reminds me of those cartoons of like Spongebob where like, you know, Patrick has like a big turkey in his mouth and then he spits it out and it's just bones. Like, how do y'all eat the meat so fast? Oh my gosh. But yeah, the black kid got his little moment in the spotlight for all of his white friends to uh, have fun with him eating chicken wings. I wouldn't let anybody record me doing that, but hey, these were the fast eaters of America, not even America, these were the fast eaters of the world. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a you know video suggestion down in the comment section below. Leave a like as well. Make sure you subscribe because I'm gonna be coming back to you with these different reactions, different videos. So if you like it, you know, why not come back next time? But that was it for this video, Team Charming, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.